So I think, I think that was it. So the next one will be with regards to, um, and this is probably a bit granular, but I'll ask it with regards to the use of ACE inhibitors and uh, okay. potential retention blockers. <laughs> Both the American College of Surgery and the Canadian Cardiovascular Societies have recommended against mm -hmm. the discontinuation of these medications. Okay. There has been a, a lot of controversy around that. I was wondering what your experience has been. I think it's a, it's a really big controversy. Because uh, um, ACE inhibitor was um, regarded as increased that is two receptor in um, in the, uh, in myocardium or in the other tissue. But uh, in my personal opinion, I think that's the, the uh, that's uh, it's not being discussed fully. And I think ACE inhibitor may increase the possibility of COVID-19 infection, the virus infection, maybe, and that's theoretically. But it, you know, if the patient had more than like three or four weeks later, like recover or admitted in the ICU, the, the nucleic acid test uh, is usually not uh, negative, and the patient have, have developed the, the antibody. So um, I don't think ACE inhibitor uh, is a major drug to control hypertension or heart failure should be stopped at this uh, stage. That's my personal opinion. Okay, Okay. for the heart problem, I have something to say that uh, as I'm an ICU doctor, not the, not, not the cardio, cardiologist, but I have to say that we must pay more attention to the right ventricular dysfunction because uh, in our patients, uh, a few of them have developed left ventricular dysfunction, but the percentage is not so, not so many, but because just the doctor who said, uh, several, only several of them developed left ventricular dysfunction. But as most of these patients are ARDS patients, and we have found that uh, about 50, maybe about 50 to 70 patients, 70 percent of patients developed right ventricular dysfunction, such as pulmonary hypertension, and you have found that enlarged right ventricle, and this may contribute to some circulatory in turbulence, instable, circulatory mm -hmm. instable of these patients. So if you uh, evaluate these patients, especially these patients' cardiac function, pay attention to their right ventricle, not only the left ventricle. Okay, 